In 2005, USS Ronald Reagan, a newly constructed $6.2 billion aircraft carrier, sank after being hit by an HSMS Gotland-class submarine with multiple torpedoes. Fortunately, this did not occur in actual combat, but was simulated as part of a war game. How could the Gotland evade Reagan elaborate anti-submarine defenses? HSMS Gotland, introduced in 1996, is a small Swedish diesel-powered submarine displacing 1,600 tons and the first to employ air-independent propulsion in its Stirling engine. A Stirling engine charges the submarine's 75-kilowatt battery using liquid oxygen. It can remain undersea for up to two weeks, sustaining an average speed of 6 miles per hour. The Stirling-powered Gotland runs more quietly than even a nuclear-powered sub. It mounts 27 electromagnets designed to counteract its magnetic signature to magnetic anomaly detectors. The Swedish naval analyst Norman Polmar said the Gotland ran rings around the American Carrier Task Force, and the Gotland was never detected. 